G'day buyers, it's Dan here from Harcourts and I just wanted to come to you live basically out of a fantastic property that I'm promoting out in Old Epping, number six, Egerton Grove. Now, to be honest with you, this is a little impromptu. I'm, I've been having ample amount of conversations with buyers as you can imagine day to day and there's an overwhelming level of feedback that I get, especially from family members, aunties, uncles, mums and dads, when we talk about the topic of first home buyers. And those young ones, younger couples, should I say, that are looking to get into the market. And they say that it's just too difficult. I feel so sorry for them. I'm not too sure where or when they're gonna find something. And I call a little bit of BS on that with respect. And what I mean by that is there are so many opportunities that are out there that are for the taking, that are value packed and are priced as to where they're going to eventually end up finding themselves competing and spending, but they get overlooked. And the reason for that, it's a little bit like going for a job or actually getting into the workforce. And how many times do we all hear and, and, and um, we all have discussions about the fact that you know, there's a lot of work out there, but the young ones just aren't prepared to actually do it. They're not prepared to start from, you know, position one and just chip away and, and work their way up. It's a little bit like that with real estate. Rightly so, everybody excited and determined to get out there and find something for themselves, but they start at the higher end of wherever they feel like they want to go, where the dream is at, and they work their way down. And that's fine, and it is great, and it is part of the process. I wholesomely get that. But what you don't factor into that process is that you actually are chipping away from your energy, okay? You start off up there and you maybe get outperformed and you realize that it's a bit, of a bit of a reach. And what happens is the opportunities that would have been perfect for you and are right for you and allow you to get a start actually pass you by without you even realizing. You get drained of your energy because your determination, your fight from the beginning is there, and then you just realize, hey, this is not all that easy. I do need to compete with other people, the like-minded people. Maybe for different reasons, they're in for the second time, but they like the same kind of property, they've got a bigger and better budget, and they just outperform. You don't know these because we're dealing with the public. The last thing that you deserve getting a start in, in, in the real estate world is for your energy, your motivation, that impetus to start and get your first home or upgrade the, the young family home to be stripped from you. My advice, wholesomely, is start off where you know there is some value where it is that you're going to end up finding. I have an incredible home out here at number six, Egerton Grove in, in Old Epping. It's on almost 950 square meters of land. All yours, one single title. It has an incredible home carved into it. The main level has three bedrooms, excuse me, the main level has three bedrooms, two bathrooms, beautiful living area, out looking over the suburb of Epping, out to an extraordinary city skyline. Views that you would arguably feel would end up costing you millions of dollars. Watch the fireworks on New Year's Eve out in Moomba as well. You just get away from it all out here at Egerton Grove. You have two extra bedrooms and a retreat area on the lower level. A spiral staircase taking you down there. So you have five bedrooms, two bathrooms on almost 950 square meters. The motivation from the sellers on this campaign is sky high. They've purchased, they're looking at closing the chapter and opening up an exciting new one. Take advantage of this market buyers, jump in where there is extreme value with where you know you're going to make an impact. Sure, the flooring and the walls, they'll deserve with a lick of paint and a bit of a spruce up and a polish, but nothing is screaming out to you, do it to me today because it can all be lived in and it can all be updated as you go. Make it a great problem for you to have, not for somebody else. It's Dan here from Harcourts. I encourage you to jump onto the Google search bar, type in this address, number six, Egerton Grove in Epping. I'm auctioning the property off April 13 at 12.30 and I'd love to hear from you. So send me an email, shoot me a text message, give me a call, and I'd love to hopefully connect you with your next 
or your first family home. Bye for now.